Preparations are complete. The final game of round 12, a top four clash. Perfect in a Brayshaw, just about close enough, and he didn't have to. Griffin Lowe's and it could be second goal ever in AFL footy. He's going to tell everyone about it. Pierce back with the flight, didn't flinch, got the spoil, got it to safety, and now he gets the love. Great build up, ace searching. It's been a long time coming, that one. Lowe. Two on two in the air, underneath Sarong. The goal beckoned, and he was happy. Very happy to accept the challenge. The uncontested possessions of late, and here they go again. Brody spears it inside, beautifully read. Matchups all over the place as we get set for the start. Round 13 from Optus Stadium. It's Fremantle and Hawthorne as we get underway. And Darcy and Reeves to go at it. It's such a good battle between those two. And Sarong, who's been in brilliant form, just bangs it forward for the Dockers, and it's a perfect start. To Sicily, long up the line, and Brett Cox with a nice intercept. Off the left boot, Sukowski with courage going back, impacted, knocked it through. Walter scooped it up. Dockers with options. Sukowski started it. Five foot complete the handball, and Schultz will finish off the good work. Now it's Fremantle's pressure, just trying to overwhelm the Hawks. Goes straight to the hot spot again. Terrific mark. We get a kick away. Butler elusive initially. Took too long. Moving a little dangerously in defence. Walker flicks the handball back. Akers continues to run. Watson it again. He's got it back from Brayshaw. Here's the run from Frio being generated. High, long ball. Logue almost out the back. Fremantle will go end to end. Walters dribbles, rolls it home. A special goal for number 300 for Michael Walters. But he'll go in short. The challenge certainly came. The Fremantle were up to the task. A successful return for Nat Fight. And 10 and 3 is a great place to be. All right, Saturday afternoon football, nice crowd in the house. What a massive day of football coming your way. Let's get things underway. Second on the ladder, the Dockers taking on the Blues. To Hewitt, dragged out from behind. Down towards Mackay on the stretch. Back to Durden, steps, run down from behind. Kick the opener of the match, Tabernet. Absolutely top shelf. Equally under pressure, Shields gets some. Up against the Port City, lowers the eyes towards Finlayson, but Brennan Cox stands tall in defence and takes the mark. With the victory, slick hands, five to Mundy, the spear pass, lays out to Lobb. Clark's got to get it back in this string of play, head towards goal, he goes to the pocket instead to Schultz. Just as hard, Al Pepper taken across the line. Young, big fly, great grab, got some hand time. It away and spills out to Sarong, who off the left boot sends it going. Caleb Sarong! Ridiculous! It's a torpedo inside 50. Get it back, Clark. He's had his own share. Sends a high ball for Yeah, tremendous courage. Both Finlayson, Bray Shaw desperate, calls the turnover. Dock is back the other way. Money, Brody releases to Wilson. Team in Fremantle. Here we go for the first quarter. Darcy a little longer. Darcy a fumble kicks across the face through the middle. Miracle goal. Come back. Darcy goes back in after it. Lays a good tackle. Couple of dockers are there. Schultz is one. Wilkie important. Brayshaw to Brody. Brody kicks and goals. Five on the bounce for Dockers. Has just shinted to Brayshaw. It's going to pay the ultimate price, you think, to the goal line. Fremantle can do no wrong. And he was beautifully tackled. Brilliant. Five fires.
goes. Fight pretty much ends it. Anywhere, anytime for Fremantle. The Dockers dominate. Another challenger discarded. And suddenly they're 12 and 4 and hunting a top two spot. So round 18 to get underway. Huge clash between two top eight sides. In season 19, the 36 year old, the steady hand, the veteran. Converts and free, I've got the first two. Bring more of the footy out of there, Chapman in front. Beats it back to Banfield, off the left, boom with the snap! Bailey Banfield! Wrestled to the ground by Ryan. Really good tackle. I think if you see persisting like this, Papley bursting onto it, and he will be caught holding the boys. Brayshaw's hard running as he just hacks it forward into the path of Lobb. They've got a man eye in the square. Lobb sends it in that direction. Schultz has to wait. 